वेलकम बैक फ्रेंड्स दिस इज द सेकेंड वीडियो ऑफ को पायलट सीरीज एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस हाउ यू कैन क्रिएट योर ओन को पायलट यूजिंग माइक्रोसॉफ्ट को पायलट स्टूडियो सो लेट्स स्टार्ट सो माई फ्रेंड इन दिस वीडियो वी विल क्रिएट अ न्यू को पायलट आई विल शो यू हाउ यू कैन क्रिएट को पायलट यूजिंग माइक्रोसॉफ्ट को पायलट स्टूडियो सो हियर यू कैन सी एज आई एक्सप्लेन वी हैव अ क्रिएट बटन हियर यू विल क्लिक ऑन क्रिएट and it will take you on a screen where you will have two options option 1 you can create a new copilot using that the option 2 you have that is new microsoft copilot action so what is use of new microsoft copilot action you already know that microsoft has multiple copilots for its applications like microsoft 365 and dynamics 365 for example microsoft 365 copilot microsoft uh dynamics 365 sales copilot and it's also has copilots for security it's also has copilot for azure so it means that if you want to add a particular action in microsoft copilot you can use this particular option but we are not going to do that so in that case my friend we will select new copilot once you will select new copilot here you can take help of copilot and you can take idea how you can create a particular copilot but i am not going to do that so i will skip this and click on create so once you will click on create it will take little bit time like 5 to 10 seconds and after that it uh, you can see a copilot is already created with a default name that is copilot it will take few seconds and after that you can change this particular name so my friend here you can see as i already explained using a created copilot then we have the knowledge base here that is where we can add, add knowledge base then topics so we'll explore each and everything for this created new copilot so now you can see name is ready i will click on edit change the name of this copilot is air india flight booking so now you can see we can also change the icon so i already downloaded a air india logo that is what i will use here and then i will save it my friend you can add description as well i am going to add a description uh, click here add description uh, demo flight booking for air india i will save it so now i updated details of copilot i created just now then we have knowledge base we are not going to touch that till that it is required once we need to add more knowledge base we'll add then we have topics we'll add topics and i will show you the flow how you can create topics and how it is related to a particular question uh, and particular context or particular type of uh, related problem in your business and then we have actions as i i already told you that uh, using actions we can create connectors we, we can create power automate flow and do any kind of automation in any third party application or microsoft 365 application and after that you can see publish information so far this copilot is not published and that why that's why you can't see here any publish status so what we are going to do right now we are going to create a very simple topic so you will have idea how you can create topic in copilot and then we'll have a small demo so i will go here and i will click on add a topic so here you have two options option 1 where you will create topic from blank means everything you have to do here you can take help of copilot and create topics so i'm going to create from blank i will click here and now you can see trigger is a phrase so what is trigger trigger means when someone is coming and asking a question that's the trigger in copilot so how copilot will trigger a particular flow that is based on that particular question so for example here we are dealing with booking so what will be the similar question for this copilot the similar question will be for example booking someone can ask and just type booking so you can use booking someone can ask book a flight someone can ask 
uh, want to book a flight so whatever the similar question you think that someone can ask that is what you can add as a phrase so now our trigger phase is already completed i will add the next step and the next step is to ask question by copilot because now copilot knew that you are going to book a fl flight so what will be the the follow up questions so the first follow up question will be from location we'll add from location i will use multiple choice here i will rename this variable so we can easily remember this that is where from location and here uh, uses my friend here we have two kind of scope the scope one is topic where your this topic will be limited i mean this variable will be limited to this particular topic but you want that this variable will be available throughout your copilot means that you have 10 topics and within 10 topics you can use this particular variable in that case you can use global but i want to make it limited to this particular topic and that's why i have this one so my friend i already changed now i will save it so we will not lose it and now i saved the next step is to ask to location so now i know from location i will add uh, another question that is to location multiple choice again we'll have we'll add this so we need to add some option as well for example delhi and pune so you can see it's adding condition for it again here i will add delhi and i will add pune for now just for demo purpose and i will use this where to location again the scope will be limited to the topic that is what i want to have now save it and now we have this then i will add another question to ask a particular date because uh, from and to after that you need a date on which date the customer wants to book a flight so booking date here we'll change this data type to the date and i will change variable name where booking date again scope will be limited to the topic that is what i want to have and saved it so now i will send a message like hello your flight is booked and thank you so this is a very uh, very simple you can say simple uh, example we will uh, explore we will make it more advanced in coming videos but let's have a demo so i will save it and now just play with it so what i will do is i will just type here book a flight So you can see even though I, I missed type but co-pilot is able to understand that I want to book a flight so from location I am giving Delhi then to location Pune then I am giving booking date 0 24 07 and 26 hello your flight is booked thanks so this is very simple flow you can see that is what we executed using microsoft copilot uh, demo one
so I want to rename it like booking and I will say and publish So this is how you can create a sample demo in coming videos i will show you that how you can make it more advanced but hope this is how you can create a simple and you will have a, a you can see like the the first hand knowledge you can see like the basic knowledge to create copilot for your business so hope you will like this video and in coming video i will show you that how you can make this copilot more advanced so please like and subscribe my channel so whenever i will upload next video you will get notification and you will learn new tips and tricks about microsoft copilot and microsoft applications so see you in next video till then bye this is sandeep Mesa signing out